What's up guys? It is, what's today? Wednesday morning, February 10th. Um, I am fixing to go to Walmart to pick up an order. <laughs> That's basically my life, um, doing Walmart pickup orders. Um, and then I actually have to go in the store because there was a few things that I forgot on my order and I clicked the like first available time slot to pick up my groceries so I wasn't able to add things to it after I submitted it so I'm gonna have to go in which is kind of annoying but it's fine but yeah I'm gonna go pick up some groceries then I'm gonna come home do dishes do laundry work out I have got to work out today because I have not worked out yet and like <laughs> it's Wednesday and I need to get three workouts in and I have not done it yet so that's terrible let me shut my bedroom door because it's kind of messy in here and y'all need to see it so yeah so i'm going to work out today that's the plan um get my steps in i've been doing good on getting my steps in the last few days um and then figure out what i'm gonna eat for dinner which I th i'm thinking i may do um the chicken i love ya i love ya I'm thinking I may do the chicken stir fry oh, yeah. that I did. Um, Carrie Underwood's stir fry, quick and easy stir fry. I'm gonna make that with the chicken. Um, that sounds good for dinner and for lunch. I may do a tortilla pizza or a black bean chicken quesadilla, but I've had a black bean chicken quesadilla the oh, past two days. Yeah. So, um, so I'm going to maybe what change it up for lunch eat? today. I'm out of pepperoni, so I've gotta wait till I pick up my groceries to actually make a pizza. So, hopefully it's not going to take us too long. I've got to pick up my groceries in about 20 minutes. So, um, usually they give me a notification about 15 minutes before. So, I'm kind of just waiting for that notification. Um, but I love the Walmart pickup. If you, if you guys have not ever done grocery pickup, I've, I've only ever done Walmart. I've never done Kroger or anything like that. But um, if you've never done it, you should do it. It's awesome, especially during the pandemic. Um, you don't have to go in, but like I said today, I'm going in. I may try to tackle Paisley's clothes again today in her closet. Um, well, not in her closet. Her closet's done, praise the Lord. Um, but I may tackle her clothes that are in totes in her room. My goal is to get the totes that are in the house full of stuff. Get them pictures taken, posted to Facebook to sell, and then get them out of the way and and meet up with people and and you know get just get get rid of them get them out of the way because i'm going insane with this clutter it's not like a bunch but there's like two two boxes of like shoes and clothes in the living room and two totes full of toys um and then in her room there's like four totes or something okay i'll give you a hug Ooh. So, I just want to get it all picked up and and organized and And then, once I get that done, I may... Can you, like, chill out, kiddo? Once I get that done, I may... Uh, sorry, she keeps hugging me very aggressively and making my voice shake. Once I get that done, I may um, open the building and get a box out at a time or so. Or just do it by size and, and get those done because it's absolutely insane how many clothes this child was blessed with and I've got to get it out of my way and organized and everything because I'm not keeping everything like there's just no no reason to keep it all like I said I can't keep all the clothes because really they're just gonna set in totes for for a long time now the special outfits like holiday stuff I've kept some of those, some of my favorite things that I think I'll never find ever again. I've kept that kind of stuff. Like cute dresses that I really love, I've kept those. But like, I can't, I just can't keep everything. I can't keep it all. So, that's kind of where I'm at. Hey, just give him one. He doesn't need more than one. Put it back up, okay? Just give him my little treats. So, yeah, that's enough rambling for this clip. I feel like I've kind of repeated myself because she was hugging me and all of that uh, <laughs> during me trying to talk. But I just wanted to kind of tell you guys what's going on today and maybe I can actually film parts of my day because I'm not working today. We're expecting bad weather. Um, so there's ice on the roads a little bit right now, I think. 
Um, at least my mom told me that there was ice on their ramp at their house and like on their porch and sidewalks. Um, there wasn't ice on my sidewalk, but I don't know how the roads are. So that's another reason why I'm doing the Walmart pickup order because I need to get some food just in case the power goes out that we can eat easier um, without having to use a stove or anything um, because we're expected to get some ice. And I remember the ice storm we had um, years ago and that was not fun. And I was a teenager then, so I wasn't a mom or a wife. So I didn't have as many responsibilities and it was, you know, my mom took care of us and we were all good, but now it's on me to, you know, make sure we have food and everything. So I gotta get some, some things that's easy to eat without having, without having to have electricity, just in case, you know, cause there, you know, I remember during the ice storm, we were without power for two weeks, so. Hopefully it doesn't end up happening that way and the weather should be better, I think, by Sunday. But just in case, you never know. I wanna be careful so, and cautious. So, so yeah, that's all I wanted to tell you guys. She's talking to me about g and G-Paw. She's very excited. I don't know. But yeah, so come along with me for the day. Uh, I'm very chatty. So that's why my clips are long because I just talk and I just keep going. So that's just how I am. So yeah, come along with me for the day and we'll see what this day holds. Hope it's a good one. Stuff adds up, you guys. Like, I feel like I didn't get that much, but um, you have to get, you know, things that just in case, just in case the power goes out, that you have those things. So, you know, I'm I'm okay to spend a little bit extra more right now. Okay. They can see you. That you're right there. Say hi. But I got all of the groceries we needed, so I'm super pumped about that. And it is, what time is it? 12.21, so we're gonna go home, eat lunch, and then um, I'm gonna lay her down for a nap, hopefully get a workout in and get some dishes done and all that stuff. Maybe edit a video, hopefully. Um, but the temperature, I feel like the temperature's really dropped since I left the house, so um, it's not raining yet. There's a little bit of like a little bit of little, little sprinkles of rain. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm trying to say on my windshield. So we're gonna get home before this crazy weather hits. Hopefully it's not as bad as they're saying it's gonna be, but in case it is, I got some soups and stuff that I can just, you know, heat up over, over a fire if I need to. Um, hopefully our power stays on and all that good stuff, but just in case, you never know, you know? So it's better safe than sorry. I was not filming, I was not recording a bit of that. So let's redo this. I'm fixing to do the aesthetically pleasing shot of making coffee. I've got my best mom ever mug my sister-in-law got me a while back and I haven't used it very much because I just drink hot chocolate. So um, I've got the donut shop, um, little coffee pods, the great value brand because I feel like that's, you know, that's good enough. And then the creamer that I got, is the silk almond creamer and it's the caramel so we're gonna see how this goes here we go it's the middle of the day too like it's 134 so cars is on in the background if you hear it sorry if it's distracting um but yeah we're gonna try this out put a lot of creamer in it um but like i said i'm trying to ease my way into liking coffee so mm. 
that's actually really good. I put two, I believe this is a teaspoon of sugar in it. Um, so I'm hoping that I figure out a way, cause I know like regular sugar is not great for you. That caramel creamer is so good. Oh my gosh, there's my pizza. Yum, yum, I'm so excited. Yeah, so I need to figure out a sweetener that's not regular sugar. I know I didn't use a whole lot of it, just like two teaspoons, but like I've seen people use liquid stevia. I know there's like syrups that you can use, which I don't know. I thought about putting honey instead of sugar. I don't know if people use honey. I need to research this stuff, but I, I wanna find a healthy way to drink coffee. Um, I'm sure there's a serving size on here. One tablespoon is 25 calories. I've probably got like two or three tablespoons in here. I should have measured it, but I didn't. But this is really good. I'm a fan. Dad, you're right. Coffee's good. Like, I mean, you can fix it up. I don't like super strong coffee because I've, I've had it, like I've tried it and I don't, I don't like it. Um, like I've had the white chocolate mocha at Starbucks and to me that was too much Like too strong of a coffee taste, but maybe now that I'm like Trying to drink it that maybe I'll do better at it. I don't know. This is really good. So I don't know if I'm supposed to be drinking it at 1 in the afternoon But it's cold outside. This is warm. I feel like I'm a mom now <laughs> Just kidding, uh, but I feel like I need one of those coffee first shirts no, I'm just kidding. Um, but cheers. So I'm pumped. I am so pumped. Like, I was nervous. I was like, I don't know if I'm going to like this or not. But I do like it. So I'm pumped. Yay. Okay. Now I'm going to eat my pizza. Then I'm going to rock my kid to sleep. Get her down for a nap. Yeah. That's, that's what we're doing. Cars is over now. So. So. We forgot to put the, the little nativity people away with our Christmas stuff. So now we got the wise man and the angel and the donkey and the camel. They're all hanging out in the kitchen floor right now. And here's Mary. I mean, Mary, you should be taking a vacation. You know, you don't come back out till Christmas. Anybody else uh, forget to put some of your Christmas decorations up? Go put those in the container where they go, okay? Go put Mary and the angel and the wise man. Put them all up. Anyways, just thought I'd share because I thought it was pretty funny. We're watching Frozen now. It kind of fits with all the ice we're supposed to get. Ice is pretty on the movie Frozen and on the trees. But that's about, that's about it. That's about it. I don't want it on the road. Don't want it on the road. So I didn't get a whole lot done during Paisley's nap today. Um, I literally just got my Bible reading done because I got sucked into Facebook post and it was one of those like Valentine's Day share your story things and that took me a while. So anywho, now I have got the laundry switched out and she's eating supper. So she did have ravioli that I fixed her in this cute little bowl. I got her at Walmart with the matching plates and cups, you know. Um, but she was over that real quick. So then I was like, well, do you want nachos? She wanted a yogurt, but she had yogurt for breakfast. So I was like, you can't have that twice. And now she's got her big girl cup and she's doing good, aren't you? You haven't spilt it yet. High five. So, yeah. Um, yeah, I need to do the dishes. Um, but Jed, my husband, is um, defrosting meat at the moment. Uh, we freeze all of our meat so that we don't have to worry about it going bad. He's making chili tonight, so he's defrosting meat. So I'm going to wait until he, he kind of, you know. Well, I guess I could check it and see if it's defrosted. Um, so I'll check that, and then I'll wash the dishes. I guess I'll put this ravioli back in the container. Because it was in like one of these like little heat-up dealios from Chef Boyardee. 
not sponsored we, we just buy them um but i did i'm pretty excited about this because with my new coffee uh drinking thing happening the keurig is back right here um jed's coffee maker was here but he doesn't hardly ever drink coffee so since i'm planning on drinking like one cup in the morning um every day um here's the keurig so i'm excited i get to film a little keurig coffee happenings in the morning when i vlog so that's gonna be cool so it's got its own little spot there and jed's coffee pot is in the pantry in the mudroom no, you gotta eat your nachos. I'm probably not working out today because it's already 6.28 and Jed's taking a nap right now and he's gonna get up at seven, so my workout's supposed to be longer than 30 minutes. So I'd like to get the dishes done before he starts cooking, that way they're out of the way. And yeah, I think I'm just gonna have a soup tonight instead of the chicken stir fry veggies and rice. I've got the rice cooked already from leftovers, but Hold on, baby. Yes, but what do you say? Me, I have me. Okay. Um, we're trying to teach her manners. Yeah, I think I'll have some soup and just heat that up and have that for supper instead of like being in the way and cooking while he's trying to cook too. So, yeah. What? You got cheese on your finger? Oh no, we'll have to get it off. Okay, well I'm gonna go pick out the the soup or whatever canned good thing that I want for supper. Eat that and then do the dishes. Get the laundry done. And just focus on that kind of stuff and then maybe work out tomorrow. Well, not maybe, like I have to work out tomorrow. I have to work out Friday and I have to work out Saturday. Like there's no ifs, ands, or buts about it. I just gotta get it in. So I need to get it in in the morning before she wakes up because um, or during her nap. And that didn't happen today, so it's just not gonna happen. Cause it's just easier because she likes to push buttons and like go to the next workout and I'm not ready to go to the next workout and I don't wanna skip a workout, so. So I decided on the light Progresso chicken noodle soup. It's only 130 calories per can. And I'm really hoping this is good because I've never had it before. But I've seen the commercials for Progresso soups and they look amazing, which that's what commercials are for, but. We'll see if it's any good. Well, that was really good. I'm, ex I'm, I'm really glad I got it. So I added four saltine crackers to it and, uh, and salt and pepper. For some reason, I like a lot of pepper in my soup. So, um, and then I had enough calories to have another Coke for the day so I picked one. I haven't drank any water today. That's absolutely terrible. I got some water. That's, you've got tea. I broke my rule of, of not drinking anything until I drink one bottle of water. And when I say bottle, I mean like my big bottle that's right there. Um, I broke my rule. But with me drinking coffee in the mornings now, um, which I'm not gonna drink coffee like as soon as I get up. I think I'll wait until, cause I do wanna try to do intermittent fasting, so I'll wait until like eight o'clock. I'm still gonna try to get up at 5.30. So from 5.30 to eight, I should have a bottle of water drink by then. Like I wake up thirsty, but I don't wake up thirsty for water yet because I haven't been drinking enough water or any water I some days. I don't like the water. You don't like the water? Well, we're gonna work on that. So, anyways, but this soup, super good. I will get it again for when I'm in a tight squeeze and, you know, can't, um, don't have time to cook or really want chicken noodle soup. It's definitely not, like, good, like, the chicken, Candice Karen Beret's chicken noodle soup that I make from scratch. Um, but, I mean, it's a good, fast soup for, you know, just being in a can. <sighs> now I gotta do dishes and laundry and get her ready for bed get her a bath and ready for bed and all that good stuff so I, i'm trying not to talk real loud about the b-a-t-h because when she hears that word she's like i want a bath which i'm glad she likes bath time but <clears throat> i'm not ready to give her one dish yet so yeah, like i said i'm gonna do the dishes do the laundry all that jazz so 
I'm gonna go because Kristoff is singing um, I'm Lost in the Woods and this is one of my favorite parts of Frozen 2 so I'm gonna go so we can watch that. I may have to rewind it because he's mid song right now and we just can't, you know, you, you have to rewind it for Kristoff. Okay, he deserves it. <laughs> so, yeah.